Hi right, YouTube. This will be part one of my homemade green sand mixer. Um, this is what I've been working on today. It's Sunday, so I didn't get nothing done yesterday. But <clears throat> I cut all my angle iron up. <clears throat> I got the uh, lawnmower transaxle. I changed my design a little bit. I, I'm always changing my designs in my head. I never write anything down on paper because it always changes. <clears throat> but <clears throat> I welded together an octagon thing here and to support this whole thing it's still a little warm I just got done welding I got uh, casters there's four casters under there and I rigged together a little coupling so the transaxle will turn the whole drum with it I still gotta rig up a little thing down here to stop that from turning I might just tack something from the angle iron here down to here so it stops turning. Um, <laughs> I just got done with the mixing bowl. Now, I, I know the welds look like total bird shit. Uh, I don't have a good MIG welder, and this stuff here is way too thin for me to weld with my big stick welder. So, um,. I have a, one of these job smart uh, little 110 flux core welder. Biggest piece of shit I've ever had in my entire life. I hate that thing. Absolutely hate it. Uh, it popped a thermal overload. Well, I don't know, while I was welding all the way around the mixing drum here. I think it popped it <laughs> six times. Uh, so if you. Don't ever, I, I don't even go buy it. It's it, the only thing I'd like to do right now is smash it with a hammer. I hate it. I get some money together. Hopefully, I get my I want to get the combo from Eastwood, the MIG, and the uh, plasma cutter. But just a little thing I've been working on today. I've been wanting to get this done for a while. Like I said, this is part one. I still have to. Uh, there'll be a piece of angle going across here um, Probably a plow there'll Be a plow here And another one here and then a weight the weight that I'm gonna make with a you know, I got this over here aluminum pipe This here I have to go smaller now. This isn't as big as I wanted it to be but it'll work this um, I'm going to put a one inch shaft through it and get it to where it's running true with my dial indicator with some bolts and everything fill it with lead um, so this will be my weight for the green sand and like I said a couple plows um, one here in the middle and then one another one over here so uh, I got to get a couple pulleys for it a pulley for the transaxle and I gotta get a pulley for the motor I still gotta mount the motor figure out how I'm gonna do it I might just have a have it swing so I don't have to rig up a tensioner and all that crap it'll just swing and the motor will be the tension the weight of the motor will be the tension of the, for the belt to run it so but it's been cloudy all day and it kinda looks like the rain is kinda coming now so I'm probably gonna call it a day. Like I said, it's Sunday, it's 4.30. I'm gonna relax a little before I have to go to bed and go to work tomorrow. But hopefully during the week I'll work on a little more. When I do, I'll uh, take some more video. See ya.